Hi, my name is Hisham Shihab. I am originally from Lebanon. I, uh, I was born in a Muslim family, conservative Muslim family in 1960, and uh, I was caught in the Civil War like any other young man. And uh, at the age of 20, I was a college student at the American University of Beirut when my only brother was killed. My only sibling was killed in the Civil War by a Christian militia. I was devastated. I wanted to take revenge, and uh, I got a silencer and a gun and wanted to stalk at my enemies to kill them off. But there was a college course that included uh, some cultural studies. One of them was uh, the New Testament, and the professor uh, chose the Sermon on the Mount. And uh, I was at the height of my, at the climax, really, of my hate when I heard for the first time, love your enemies from the Sermon on the Mount. I thought, wow, this is superhuman. So I started reading the Bible on, on my own. This is really shows the power of the word of God. It's like dynamite, as the uh, gospel says, as the uh, New Testament, as St. Paul says, the gospel is the power of God. Uh, it's a long story, but in 2001, I bumped into a retired Lutheran pastor in an elevator in Beirut. He came to revive the Lutheran Hour ministry in Beirut, and uh, he was looking for somebody to help him translate his Bible studies into Arabic. He was like a lone ranger looking for Tonto, and he found me. So we teamed up together, and... Uh, I started ministering to different Muslim communities in Lebanon. Uh, in 2004, uh, I was called to come to uh, uh, Concordia Seminary in Fort Wayne. I moved to the United States, and uh, just before I finished seminary, I was called to move to Chicago, really. In Chicago, I wasn't sure. It's really a difficult place. And I was living then in Michigan, commuting to Fort Wayne, Indiana. And I thought after my experiences with the traffic in Chicago, I should outsmart the people and travel at night to avoid the traffic, you know. And I set out from an Arbor, Michigan at 9 p.m., from an Arbor, Michigan, to beat the traffic. As soon as I hit 294, I discovered something. In the daytime, you fight crazy drivers and sit in traffic. At night, they close all lanes and keep one lane open for traffic, for, I mean, uh, roadworks. And you sit in traffic again, but at night behind trucks. And uh, I thought, wow, I'm called to plant a, an Arabic church in this difficult land. This is a mission impossible. But what is impossible with man is possible with God. In two months, I was giving a food basket uh, for Easter in two, three months, really, in uh, Wheaton, Illinois, when I bumped into a woman who was a refugee uh, in Lebanon, Palestinian refugee. She was like the Samaritan woman to me. She went out and told everybody about the ministry. In two months, we started a Bible study. In, uh, in summer 2007, we baptized seven people, and then we started a fellowship. In 2008, an Arabic uh, Christian Fellowship. In 2008, March 2008, we started the first regular worship service, and it's still going on till today. We baptized 15 people in uh, three years, and uh, we, we spread the gospel. We go to uh, where the people are from the Middle East to tell them about the love of Christ and that God loves them, and he gave his only son for their salvation.